Hey, Adrian LaFosse here with the Columbia New Home Buyer Team in Columbia, South Carolina. Actually, we're in Casey, South Carolina today, um, right on the verge of Columbia. It's actually sort of almost almost in the city limits of West Columbia, just across the river from uh, the main part of downtown Columbia. We're in the neighborhood of uh, Concord Park. Uh, it's actually very close to Scanna and Amazon and a bunch of other industry. And actually, we're not concentrating on the neighborhood today. We're actually concentrating on this new floor plan by this by Hurricane Builders. Hurricane Builders, a very well-respected uh, builder in the area, always innovating, always doing something new, adding something great to their new houses. This is a Savannah floor plan, over 3,100 square feet, both formals, huge kitchen, huge family room, uh, loft upstairs, incredibly great size uh, master. So I thought this would make a great video tour that you can go ahead and see this uh, particular floor plan. Uh, this house is actually for sale in Casey, South Carolina, but this home is available everywhere you want to be. It, it could be in Irmo, Northeast Columbia, uh, uh, Lexington, uh, you can find this home. Now typically, as you see this home right here with some stone accent and a two-story beautiful uh, porch, it's usually priced in the in the 190s to the low 200s uh, with uh, then it's a vinyl siding on the other three sides. For all brick, you know, that can vary. It could be in the two, um, 230s, 240s or so. Um, depending on neighborhood, could be a little bit higher, but it's for all brick. So let's go ahead and um, we're just about to go ahead and start our tour. Now remember, uh, here at the Columbia New Home Buyer Team, we don't represent uh, builders, but we represent buyers of new homes. And you can find us online at ColumbiaNewHomeBuyer.com. So let's go ahead and do this video tour of the Savannah. Again, you'll notice it's got the bay window right there on the second floor that's actually the master bedroom, a two-story porch, the stone accents we already pointed out, a decorative door, uh, these are pretty much standard features that you're going to find on the Savannah, uh, pretty much just about every neighborhood that they have. Now this home is, um, like I said, for sale. It's um, it's a, what we call a spec home, means there's not a buyer for it. Somebody didn't specifically ask to have it built, um, but it's here ready for somebody to close as quickly as possible. Now you will notice a few things that are incomplete in the house, but this is pretty much a 98, 99% complete house that could be ready within a week <laughs> if you if you can get the funds and get it done. Now you notice we're first greeted here. This is a feature that um, only a couple other builders are offering as a standard feature and a, a few more are jumping in and that is these wood treads on the steps and this wrought iron style of the right here. I mean this is this is incredibly beautiful. I mean this is a pretty penny when you have to pay builders to upgrade. Also you'll notice these hardwoods right here, these beautiful hardwoods on the entire downstairs are amazing. And, you know, just like five years ago, it used to, it used to pretty much if there was any hardwoods, it would just be here in the hallway, maybe in this a formal living room, and then you had to pay. So there's basically, I mean, I am not stretching here. There are thousands upon thousands of dollars worth of hardwoods in here that you had to pay for. And pretty much they've added them and the price hasn't gone up as that, the price has actually gone down. Another thing that you'll notice, I mean, you're just inundated with great architectural features. You know, the, the arch uh, doorways, the uh, two-piece crown, the shadow boxing, the framed uh, windows. That's all standard. Also, this builder is very unique that they offer uh, blind packages. It's really two-inch wood foam, beautiful blinds included in the price. You also notice that the light fixtures are an upgrade here. The electricity is not on, so I hope it's not too dark. So that was, that's a formal living room, an office. Now right here is the formal living room. Actually an exceptionally large one. Again with the two-piece crown, the shadow boxing, hardwood floors. And you can see the kitchen right there, but actually we're gonna walk in here down, continue down the hall, and you're going to notice the kitchen on your left right here, and then the family room. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and swing around, and uh, you'll notice the built-ins and the fireplace. I believe fireplace is now 
becoming standard. It depends on the neighborhood, but I think it's pretty much almost standard in all uh, hurricane builders' homes from now, now on. So I'm going to swing around here and show you that's very inviting into the kitchen. Granite countertops. You'll notice a, a very nice upgraded cabinetry. You'll notice the crown molding on the cabinetry as well as um, the stair stacking. Uh, you know, it's just not just one dimension going straight across. Now, there's no appliances uh, in, in the house quite yet. There, it does come standard with a microwave and a stove uh, range below and a dishwasher. That, that's totally standard. Uh, and actually their standard now is stainless steel. So uh, they just wait until the house is under contract before they actually go ahead and install those. So looking across, you know, so these really nice lighting fixtures, the granite countertops, the deep sink. And I also do want to mention, this is not standard on every Hurricane Builder's house, but um, especially on their larger ones, uh, and again, depending on neighborhood, and you can always upgrade it if it doesn't come with it, uh, you'll notice this, uh, this covered porch right here. And I think that the price, I'm not exactly sure of the price they would, they would charge if you had to add it on, but I remember it, it ended up being, it was a very reasonable price compared to what other builders are charging. As I said, this builder, uh, Hurricane Builders, they're always innovating, they're always doing something new. I mean, just recently they upgraded their, their cabinetry, they didn't have to, it was nice cabinetry, but they, they even made that even better. So that's the, the first floor here. Um, actually, just off of the family room was the, um, was the garage. And let's go ahead and go up these beautiful wood treads right here, up the stairs. All right, and you'll first notice a loft, an extra living space upstairs. But you also notice that there are closets. There's a closet space right there. So if you wanted to build this house with a fifth bedroom, this would be the fifth bedroom right here. So actually, let, let's do this. Let's go back to the front of the house here. And this is the largest secondary bedroom, just really good size. And you'll notice that it goes out to the two-story porch. Okay. And then the loft, we've seen that. Now, again, this is something that's standard with Hurricane Builders. It's, it's a pretty penny upgrade for the other builders, and that is tile in the bathrooms. Even the secondary, and there's granite countertops. And there's not a, 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 a mirror yet there, but there will be. And then actually, this is beautiful. Um, I'm not 100% sure if this is a standard feature. This might be an upgrade, but you notice this is a garden tub shower. Instead of the smaller tub shower, this is a garden tub shower. And I think it's because of the design of, the, um, of the, this part of the room that it can actually fit one. And of course, that's where the toilet will be right there. So it's not installed. Okay, and now there's uh, two bedrooms off the back. Very good size bedroom right here. And then another secondary one. It's not as big as the others, but honestly, it's actually larger than, than most. So this is actually a good size to be the smallest one. And remember, this is the Savannah. It's uh, built by Hurricane Builders. And if you want a, a floor plan, I can provide that we would with you that as well. Laundry room, right here. Tile again. All right, this is the room that you've probably been waiting to see. This beautiful, massive, just inviting master bedroom with the bay window, tray ceiling. And you actually have two rooms, including the master, that can get you to the, the two-story porch. So much to see here. I'm going to go ahead and swing back around.
All right, and then you'll notice the master bathroom. Oh, I do want to point this out. You'll notice that right now there is just a wire sticking out right there, and then you'll notice a wire sticking out right there. Hurricane Builders is very unique in this, and they do three zone heating and air systems. So you've got a thermostat downstairs, a thermostat upstairs, and you get a thermostat in the master. So you can really keep your house nice and regulated. It helps with efficiency too, uh, as far as uh, how you want to heat and cool it. Now again, tile, double sink vanity, mirrors just not installed yet. You got a water closet there, and then garden tub with that frosted block. Really love that because most builders that don't have that, that's another $400 right there if you can add it. Very nice size shower with a seat and a very large, very large master closet. Right, swing around here. All right, well, that's the Savannah, um, over 3,100 square feet built by Hurricane Builders. And pretty much everywhere you want to be, uh, they, build, they build this home in a neighborhood in, all around Columbia. So this has been a video tour by the Columbia New Home Buyer Team. I'm Adrian LaFosse, uh, team leader. Uh, you can find us online at ColumbiaNewHomeBuyer.com. You can also reach us at 800-620-1323. We don't represent this builder. We represent buyers of new homes. So, I, so we can help you with any builder anywhere in the greater Columbia area. And I hope you enjoyed today's video tour. And be sure to check out our YouTube page and our, our Columbia New Home Buyer web, website to find dozens of other new home builder videos and other informational videos. So I hope you enjoyed this one. See you on the next one.